One thing about Victoria is she will keep it classy, always, while the other girl is here ranting up and down, doing the media rounds that she's accusing others of. She's the one doing it. It doesn't make sense to me. Anyway, hello guys, what's up? And welcome to Spicy Updates with Lovely On. I hope you guys are doing okay. Please do not forget to hit the like button and be subscribed to the YouTube channel. Thank you so much, as always. You guys, <laughs> as the heat is continue to go on, what? Victoria and Ozzy continue to bond and laugh and whoa, you guys, I don't even know. This Victoria girl is a silent operator. Now, Ozzy was asking Victoria, you know, whether she's going to clear things up, you know, kind of like change that narrative. Victoria said she, no, 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 no. Everything remains at the, what am I going to clear? What am I going to say? Anybody can feel However way they want to feel, anybody can think whatever they want to think. That's not her problem. And the fact that she has just stood her ground. Even TJ, you know, yesterday she was having this conversation with TJ when they're talking about it. Because TJ now is acting like the middleman. He will go here, he will meet this person. Ah, Victoria said this, this, this. He, I said, ah, are you just trying to gather information? Or you have a remedy to this? Meanwhile, this Onyeka girl has just been talking about Victoria and Cassia. Victoria and Cassia were having conversation. They were just talking about Ben, that he miss Ben, his funny jokes and all that. To, uh, what's her name, Onyeka. Victoria and Cassia are talking about her. And both Victoria, Nelly and Suj, they have, ha they, in fact, they have a common enemy now, who is Victoria. I don't know what's Suj's problem with Victoria. Is it because Victoria nominated her? I don't know what's Nelly's problem with Victoria. Like, at the end of the day, this Victoria has not even spoken anything about anyone. At all. She did not say anything about uh, Onyeka. She didn't say anything about, uh, what's her name, Nelly. Not even Suj. But at the end of the day, Onyeka is not even pained that her sister left. Onyeka is not even pained that she's about got evicted. Uh -uh. Onyeka is pained because of Ozzy and Victoria. And if you ask me why, I do not know why. You mentioning that your Ozzy's favorite is another thing that is kind of like is blowing my head because I don't even know where that one is from. From where to where? Your Ozzy's favorite. So who is the one competing? Guys, let me ask you. Who is the one competing in the house? You are competing with somebody who hasn't even seen you as a competition. I don't know why Victoria has not even had this conversation with Sean. Though I know they are no longer a pair. But I feel Sean is close to Onyeka. And Sean has been a friend from the outside. Though they came into the house and I don't know. But then Sean is somebody that's knew her way from outside so i think it's even very okay for her to but she said she doesn't want to insert herself in anything that has to do with ozzy and Erika's case again she doesn't want that narrative she doesn't want because tj even came the way she just cleared tj tj said eh Onyeka said you did this one you like ozzy. victoria said who said i dislike ozzy like just shut them out like that let tj know that you're not even in for any sort of unnecessary conversation because Oyeka just wants to indirectly make people see Victoria as I don't know. Meanwhile, Victoria and Ozzy have been vibing. In fact, Ozzy was asking her to give him pictures, the pictures she brought to the house. You know, they are just talking about family. And he also said he wished she even brought some like he's wondering how his family, his parents are doing. He just thinks about them, what's going on with them and Victoria said, I think it's the only one she brought or she didn't even bring anyone. And there was one she would have brought when she was a kid or something that her dad cut her hair and she looks more like a boy. So you can see that they are just having very calm. The thing that used to be Ozzy, OC and uh, Onyeka Chizoba is now Ozzy, OC, Victoria. Sometimes Cassia will join them. <laughs> you guys, it's really very funny. But... Honestly, this thing should be a lesson to Onyeka because I think Onyeka's mouth is just the problem. You cannot be calm in situations. Since morning, you guys, since morning, we have been talking about Victoria. Onyeka has been doing media rounds. All her talk is Victoria and Ozzy. Onyeka has not left that. She has not. She's so pained. Why? 
why do you think god has vindicated you god is exposing do you have are you are you Ozzy's friend did Ozzy own up that Ozzy mentioned that there's nothing there and he even know that nothing will happen Ozzy has not claimed you you self acclaimed you you claimed him and you're saying you're his favorite did he tell you you're his favorite did Ozzy open his mouth and say, Onyeka, you're my favorite. To tell you, shallow brain, nobody should come for me. Yes, yeah, so that is, I'm really surprised that even as you guys level, you're claiming that she graduated at, uh, she graduated in 2018, is does call to bar, does this on handle cases, and any small thing somebody tells you, you're overthinking it and magnifying it to be what is not. Ozzy say you're his favorite. Was it because... He said he was going to throw a birthday bash for you. Or was it because he said he was going to make you his priority? He was going to do this one. Then, how is your attitude? You don't want to get all that from him. All you do. Because he is somebody you claim you like. You do this one. Then, since yesterday night, you have been talking about him. He did this. He did that. He did that. How do you think, even if he wants something do you think he will come back to you with all this attitude meanwhile look at the calm victoria unproblematic nobody's dragging anyone but i was he talks to you first okay you guys remember that after that whole thing that ozzy called victoria they had a conversation i don't know if you guys remember that he has been on here at a time save all of them were on the same bed onyeka Usi and ozzy onyeka was even making mad that oh she was she enjoyed her sleep when she rode to this side it's ozzy she rode to this side it's ozzy did victoria confront ozzy no even when both of them were doing their lovey dovey did victoria confront ozzy no did victoria talk about it with cassia no did she discuss it with anybody in the house no then what is this woman's problem I'm still asking, what is Onyeka's problem? Onyeka is the one that has the big issue. I don't know. She's the one that has the biggest issue. She's the one that has an issue. And with all of this, I'm telling you, Ozzy is just seeing clearly and he will run. Because if you can be like this inside the house, outside the house, it's going to be worse. And the fact that OC has not even gone to her to even talk about it or to even say, Oh, she's about life, let me be this. I mean, OC, not even OZ. She tell you that it's, there's a limit to what somebody can actually take. And the way she's blowing it out of proportion is way too much for her age. Imagine OZ saying, that Victoria, when Ozzy was having conversation with Chisoba a night before she left, Ozzy said, can you imagine that Victoria is even the youngest, but see the level of maturity she exudes. That Victoria is youngest. So invariably, Onyeka is even older than Victoria. Eh? Onyeka is way older than Victoria, but see the way Onyeka is just like, are you obsessed with Victoria? In fact, I think the whole, all, all, all of them, are you obsessed with Victoria? She has not even said anything. But anybody that comes to her from conversation, she's like, please, I don't want to talk about. It. Please, I don't have. To. She's just discussing general different things with Ozzy. But well, anyway, everybody wants peace. So nobody wants bad boys. Since she doesn't want to give, she doesn't want to rest. Give herself some unrest. And Victoria is also having her cut. Whether you per se narrative or whether you per se anything, it doesn't affect who she is and. What she's doing, still having her cool time with Ozzy. Even if tomorrow Ozzy reconciles with Tereka, she will not even see you. That's just one thing about her. And I believe she's just keeping it very classy. Demir, courtesy. If you have eyes, you will see. Even with the viewers know that Oheka is just playing the victim. And the bet the earlier she stops, the better for her. Share your thoughts in the comment. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.